530. Welcome to Political Talk with Leslie, Dang Leslie Danks, Burks, and Tom Santoli. Governor Cuomo has a plan to charge drivers $25 to get a new license plate, but Senate Minority Leader John Flanagan calls this the latest example of Albany's nickel and diming of the hardworking middle class taxpayers. Now, Leslie, are these license plates worth it or is it just a waste of money? The problem is it's both. And what we're looking at is a failure to plan in advance. It's like if you go to Costco and you buy a huge package of toilet paper, it's a lot cheaper than if you buy each one of those rolls individually. And we did not plan in advance for this, and so now we're getting uh, hit with this fee. And that's not on Governor Cuomo, quite frankly. The, the Republicans who are screaming about this uh, were in charge of the legislature 11 short months ago. So, you know, this, this lack of planning has been coming down the pike for a while. And I also will note that the same Republicans who are very upset about this new fee don't seem to have any problem with the fact that uh, President Trump just blew through a $1 trillion deficit today. Yeah. And Tom, local assemblyman Phil Palomino says that any license place cost should have been included in the state budget. Is this right or is it a fee that well, we Well, it's kind of well? interesting. I kind of look at the world a little differently. New York State has a $177 billion budget. The only budget that's larger is $214 billion. That's California. So this, is a, this will generate $75 million. Uh, in new money, these license plates, because if your license plate's over 10 years, there's 3 million people that have license plates over 10 years, it generates 75 million. So I kind of look at it and say, in a $177 billion budget, Pennsylvania has a $34 billion budget, we're $177 billion, we can't find $75 million. No, this is about the generation of money, and everybody in elected office does that. We look for new ways to find money. And this morning and yesterday, it wasn't just Republicans. There are Democratic uh, senators who are against this and saying, this is nothing but a money grab. That's what it is. Now, listen, I can't make a judgment call whether yeah. how old the license plates are and whether they need to be replaced. I think we do it every 10 years. So, listen, with all the problems there are out there, with all the things that are going on, to me, this is a big nothing. I mean, uh, these, we, are, these are license plates. I absolutely. Mean. We've got a lot of challenges out there. But I think that one thing the two of us probably could agree on is if you're going to go online and vote for a license plate, pick one with a picture of Upstate on it because, yeah. <laughs> gosh almighty, Mighty. the entire state is not about New York City and four out of five of those license plates uh, yeah. look like they're just for New yeah. York City. So we've got to pick a license plate that includes Upstate. Absolutely. absolutely. You know, equal. We, we should have equal time. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Well, thank you both for coming in today. And that does it for this week's Political Talk. And 18 News will be right back after the break.